guys, so today I'm going to do the $20 makeup challenge and I was super excited to film this for you guys because I've been watching these go around and it's just kind of fun to see the products that people choose and how they use them in different ways. So yeah, I was kind of excited to put my take on it. It definitely kind of makes you like have to dig through your collection and find stuff that um, is reasonably priced that you can put um, in a video under $20. So yeah, some of the stuff I already had and some of it I did have to go out and buy. But with that being said, this is like the first time using some of it and I wasn't totally impressed with all of it. Like the Essence eyebrow pencil um, for my eyebrows is really, really waxy and I just did not like it at all. You guys know I love the e.l.f. eyebrow kit, so I definitely recommend that one over this one. And the mascara I used, I wasn't that impressed with, but everything else wasn't too bad at all, and some of the stuff I've actually used before, and I really liked it. I'm using my favorite foundation right now, which I mentioned in my August favorites video, if you guys saw, and it's the Ramel Clean Finish Foundation. So you guys can see that in action, and I am going to do a look, like my everyday school look, using this as well. I didn't use a powder, a setting powder, for this look, but you definitely don't have to. This foundation holds up really well with that one. So yeah, this is kind of just like an everyday, natural look. Um, I think it's really perfect for like school or work. It's just really easy and effortless and very natural looking. So if you guys want me to do like more of a darker night look, like $20 makeup challenge, um, then I can do that too. Just let me know. But I think that's about it. I'm not going to make this intro super, super long because I know you guys hate that. So yeah, so if you guys want to see how to do this look under $20, then keep watching. I'm going to start by taking the Ramel Clean Finish poreless foundation and I'm just gonna apply this all over my skin just using my fingers um, because I didn't want to obviously use a brush because that would have taken up more money so I'm just using my fingers which actually works pretty well for this foundation then I'm gonna take the essence cover stick concealer and I think mine's in medium and I'm just gonna use this to apply underneath my eyes to cancel out the dark circles I'm also going to take a little bit of it and put it on my eyelids um, to cancel out any redness and to also kind of serve as a primer. And then, yeah, I'm just going to use it on my blemishes as well. And I am breaking out right now, so ignore that. Then I'm going to take the e.l.f. lipstick in Classy and I'm going to use it two ways. I'm going to use it as a blush which is like the oldest trick in the book, but you're just going to kind of dot it on your cheeks and blend it out. And then I also used it on my lips, and it's just a really natural pink color, which is perfect for every day, and it's only a dollar, which is amazing. Then I'm going to take the Essence Eyebrow pencil in blonde, and I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows. This pencil was actually really, really bad, and doesn't look very good. I don't recommend it. It was like $2 and I would save your money and pick up the e.l.f. one. It's just so much better. Then I'm going to take the end of the pencil which had like a little brush on it and kind of brush through it to try to make it look a little better but it didn't really work. Then I'm going to take this e.l.f. palette and I'm going to take the lightest kind of white champagne color and put it all over my eyelid. And I know I said it a million times. And then I'm going to take this taupe color from the palette, which is really pretty, and just put that through my crease, kind of concentrating it more on like my outer V. Oh yeah, baby, give me one more night. And then I'm just going to take my finger and kind of softly blend it out a little bit. And then I'm going to take the kind of white shimmery shade again and put that right underneath my brow bone as a highlight. Then I'm going to take the e.l.f. liquid eyeliner in black and apply a line on the top of my lash line. And I'm going to kind of wing it out a little bit. This eyeliner was really hard to work with. Um, I'm not used to like a brush applicator. I like the felt tip a little bit more. So yeah, you can see me trying to make a wing. And I know I've said it a million times, but I only stay with you one more night. And then I'm just gonna apply the Essence All Eyes on Me mascara um, to my top and bottom lash line. 
that was it. I hope you guys liked this look. And if you've done one of these, then you should video respond to it. I would love to see it. Um, and don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. And I think that's about it. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. But baby, there you go again, there you go again, making me love you.